there's multiple, you know, tips and tricks to managing multiple accounts because you don't want to post the same content on all of them, right? Because the way I managed to grow all the accounts, you know, I think we've got eight of them that are over 300,000 followers today is because we diversify the content. So if I'm going to post something on my page, Mr. Good Life, I'm going to go post the exact same photo the next day or the same day on Life of Billionaire. Even if they're in the same niche, it makes absolutely no sense. So the best way to manage them, multiple accounts, well, first of all, you have to manually do it because Instagram does not allow any sort of automation, as most of you probably know that. Uh, there's no app out there today that will go and post for you. So you either have to hire someone or have a team working for you or you have to do it yourself. Uh, currently, uh, I have about eight people running 12 of my pages uh, because I've got to the point where I really have time to be posting five, six times a day on every single page. That's like 60, 70 posts per day, which is crazy. Um, so the way I manage it is that I have a team, like I said, um, they post regularly, I would say four or five times a day on each page. Uh, and besides that, there's a bunch of little tools and applications you can use on the side to help you schedule, like Hootsuite. Um, Hootsuite, I would say, is the only application you use. It's, 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 complete. it's a great, great, great app. Basically, what it allows you to do is schedule in advance. So there's no you know, time frame you can schedule as long as you want. So let's say today we're May 30th. I want to post for June 5th. So I'll schedule it for the time and exact date. I'll put in the post and the caption. And then the application on June 5th at that time will send you a reminder. I will click on it and it will prepare the post. All I have to do is share on Instagram. But see, you still need that human interaction because Instagram really, really doesn't allow and you know, like uh, automation and bots. Absolutely, you can be uh, absolutely. You can be banned. Like you're, you've created a, a following of three hundred thousand, or you've spent hours and months um, pulling uh, together these followers, and then you do something that's automated, and it can. It's very risky. You're walking the line of um, getting banned there. So I understand. Oh. Um, so you've got eight people working for you. Um, uh, what are what are they doing? What are their day to day? Um, you know tasks are they literally just posting posting for you are they creating the images the captions can you just walk us through uh, that yeah so so basically what they're doing is i ask them to post content regularly because to me there, there are three golden rules to 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 a successful instagram page so number one is you have to be unique and different so it goes back to what i was saying earlier you have to post unique content you don't want, uh, people don't want to see thing, thing posted over and over and over and over and over again on multiple pages, which is what put us apart and made my entire brand stand out from the others, which is why we grew so fast in, in, in the last year. The second rule is content. You need good, good, good content. Uh, that's, you know, that's an obvious one. And the third rule is you need to network a lot. So what I ask uh, the people that are running my pages is to post, let's say, three to six times a day per page in order to keep you know, in order to keep the page running. Because as you know, the APIs of Instagram make it so that not everybody sees um, the, your posts. So if you post regularly, then you're sure that at every time of the day, people will be seeing you on the news feed, right? So this is what I ask them. Uh, we make our own captions as well. So they have to come with cool call to actions. Let's say I'm posting like uh, a cool photos of two cars. I'll be like, pick one and tag a friend. Or if you're, you're tagging um, on my love pages, the people that are posting love photos are saying like, you know, tag your, tag your loved one or, you know, things like that. Um, we come up with their own descriptions. And when it comes to the advertising to the business side, I still take care of it uh, because I like, you know, being on top of, of my business and what's going on. I like, you know, making sure that I make the post right for my clients. But besides that, I usually sometimes when I don't have time to do it, you know, just send them over and be like, hey, can you post this at that time exactly, blah, 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 or set up on Hootsuite so that you can just have it there on their phone. 